Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I'm going to be telling you how much money I've earned from over 200,000 views. But before I show you my analytics and how much I've exactly earned on YouTube, please make sure to subscribe and hit the thumbs up button to help me support me on my journey to 3,000 subscribers. I will also ignore my hands, they are dyed, I cannot get it off, trust me, I've tried in college I had to flick some dye onto some paper and it got all over my joggers, all over my hands, I'm just gonna have to ignore that. But anyway, now let's get on to the juicy details. So, since having this channel, I've got over 579,000 views, to be precise it's 579.1k views, which is a lot um and i'm so thankful for all of that because i didn't even realize how big of a number that is but since being monetized i've got 239,000 views and i got monetized in june on june the 8th so i've been monetized for five months well just short of five months um and bearing in mind you like thinking about the fact that i have nearly 250,000 views since being monetized you would think okay like she's talking about maybe a grand maybe more maybe even 500 pounds like who knows but sadly my cpm is very low so cpm is cost per milli um and that is basically how much you get paid per thousand views and that averages from about 50p to like astronomical numbers i think on average it's around five to ten pounds for most people a lot of people just have it as two pounds but on one of my videos i had a, my top cpm for that one video was 346 pounds and that only has like less than 100 views but anyway that's irrelevant so cpm does vary is what i'm trying to make the point of but in total my cpm is very very low I'm only going to tell you the analytics since being monetized. Also, I'm looking down at my laptop if I keep looking down um, because obviously it's not relevant before then. But since being monetized, my CPM on average for the last five months has been £3.07, which is actually pretty good. But um, that is before YouTube's cut um, and a before a few other things. I don't actually know what they are. But RPM is what you actually get paid per thousand views. And that is 71p. So I've averaged at getting paid 71p per thousand views. Now that's not bad. I get between 1,000, no, I get between 500 and 1,000 views per 24 hours. So I get paid around a pound a day. Um, the other day it peaked, I got like £3.45 and then sometimes it drops like 58p a day, but it fluctuates. I've moved up so I can pop a screenshot in here. But in total, since being monetized, I've had 239,000 views. I've had 9,000 watch hours, 799 subscribers, and I've made 170 pounds. That is the reality of being a small YouTuber. For most people, having 239,000 views, they would get a lot more than that. But I think it's also based on the big mistakes that I made of making my viral video which has most of my money is where most of it comes from that is less than five minutes that is just over five minutes long which is less than eight minutes and if you don't know videos that are over eight minutes long get ads in between so i could be making 10 times the amount of money if i had an extra two and a half minutes onto it which is quite sad because i could be now talking about 500 pounds rather than 170 pounds but i'm very grateful for even having 170 pounds that's amazing but can I just add that one of my videos is actually an ineligible, 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 ineligible for monetization because it's got a copyright claim. I uploaded it before getting monetized. I uploaded it on the 21st of April um, and that video now has 30,000 views, but I'm not getting paid for that. So actually cut that from the views from before, um, but it's still 71 people, a thousand views. But yeah, that is basically my tip. My biggest tip is to A, make your videos over eight minutes long and b um make sure there's no copyrighted content on music because it will hit you when you get monetized you will hate no you will be so annoyed at yourself for not doing those things because i could be making so much more money and also i could remove the music but there are so many copyrighted songs in it because it's tiktoks um, and i'm not going to do that um, and I'm pretty sure the only reason it is getting views is because there's music in it because some of my other videos that don't have music in which I've removed the music in have a bit less views 
So the amount of money that I make really varies on what the video is about. So if it's a sit down video of me, usually that does a lot better than my completions. But now I'm going to talk about how many views I've got on each video since being monetized, how much money that's made me, my RPM, average view, just things like that. And I'm going to tell you those. Obviously, I'll put the analytics here so you can see what I'm seeing. But since being monetized, um, my video that has top performed is TikToks that will give you baby fever because that does have the most views. That has made me £95.57. And, and since being monetized, it's got 154,423 views. But in total, it has like 221,000. Um, so obviously, the views before that is what got me monetized. And then the 154,000 is what's made me the £95. Um, then the CPM is £2.59. RPM is 62p, which is not high at all. Um, and watch time has, I've got 6,000 hours from that. Obviously, that is my top performing video that's making me the most money. But here is something interesting. Think about this my last video from 154,000 views has made £95, right? Now, this one is my second best performing, and that has only made me £12.55. That's how to tell your parents about your IBF. But that only has 4,000. 397 views but here's the crazy thing that proves that views don't equal money it's all based on cpm because think about this my tiktoks that will give you baby fever video has 154,000 views since being monetized and that's maybe 95 pounds but yet only 4,000 views has made me 12 pound 55 from how to tell parents about your ibf 95 pounds 154,000 views 12 pounds 4,000 views. I've made 10 times more money on the TikTok video, the baby fever video, but I've got like so much more views. So obviously I have a really high CPM. Like on the second one, the CPM is £5 and I get paid £2.86 per thousand views compared to getting paid 62p per thousand views for the baby fever video. Does that make sense? Does that prove that a video with a lot less views gets me more money or more money per thousand views compared to my baby fever video? That's madness. And then my baby fever part two video has made me 11 pounds and I've got 8,577 views from that. And then IBF meetings 2019 has made me 8 pound 30 for 12,000 views. And then £7.51, uh, £5.75, 5 dollars 232 it goes down, but the views and money really vary. You can see here what I'm talking about. But then look at how crazy this is. If you look down at my small business check, TikTok completion 2020, that has a CPM of £40.33 compared to the others, which are like really low Ooh, actually how to make easy money as a teen is a 31 pound i've never even seen that so there are really low and really high cpms but that one which is the 40 pound the business check has only had 87 views so if that had a thousand views i'd make like 40 quid well 17 because of my rpm but that is a lot of money compared to a low amount of views it really proves that it bounces but yeah, in total, since being monetized, I've made £170 from 250 nearly 1,000 views. That is not good for 250,000 views because I have a low CPM, but I'm very grateful to have made that much. That is amazing. But anyway, I really hope you've enjoyed hearing how much I earned from getting 200,000 views. That is an astronomical number. And maybe when I get like in total on my channel, like a million views, or I will basically update you in the future with how much money I'm earning then and things like that. And I will dive deeper into my analytics because I think people do enjoy it. I enjoy seeing other people's analytics. So I'm sure you enjoy seeing mine as a small YouTuber. But yeah, I really hope you enjoyed this video. Please make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe and let me know what you think about my analytics and tell me about yours down below or link me to your video if you've done a video like this and I'll be sure to check it out. But anyway, I will see you in my next video. Bye guys.